This is a message to Dark Underlord. Um, you're a good leader. I realize that now. I've realized it for a long time. But there were times where my, you know, um, beliefs wavered. But after seeing how Rusty handles his forum, and after witnessing the fucking um, tranny shitting in mouth, tampon licking, sniffing, um, degenerate, disgusting shit that I won't even mention, discord shit, I realize that you run the best forum on the entire internet. And I realize that I'm an alcoholic and I'm an ass. But just please do not redirect me to Rusty's forum. Please, for the love of God. It's the worst. I don't want to have anything to do with those fucking people. 99% of the people on Rusty's forum are also those same fucking Discord idiots that I had to talk to for months and months. And I want nothing to do with them. If you just let me back on the forum 100%, no redirects, I will provide the best Diablo 4 videos, as I've been doing. Um, I don't think anybody else compares to me as far as Diablo 4 content goes. There's nobody else providing Diablo 4 content. Um, it's just me. And I'm showing the good sides of the game. But I'm being fair, and I'm showing the bad sides, too. Like the, um, collecting Lilith statues thing. Like, I made a post about that. There's a lot of shitty stuff in this game. But when the game works, the game fucking works. I mainly, at this point in time, um, as far as my existence on the Codex goes, is I want to talk about my Diablo 4 experience. And, you know, you need somebody there to do that. It, well, it seems like every single fucking thread has the same types of roles being played. There's a troll, which is Saravan. By the way, Saravan, I want to see you upload a video of you doing what I do in Diablo 4 and World Tier 2. I won't even ask you to do world tier three i just want to see you do the type of stuff that i do in world tier two i'm not i'm not gonna ask that much of you let's see what you got kiddo um i forgot where else i was going with this um and you know you want i get a lot of people asking me you know, why don't you play more turn-based games? Well, I, I fucking... Uh, I'll get around to it. I'm playing... There's that Aliens game. That's... C the, the tactical, the Dark Descent, that's technically... Um... Yeah, so I'll get around to it. And I'm doing all sorts of things to improve my life. I've stopped drinking at work. It is the weekend. I'm mixing vodka with energy drinks just to be able to improve my level. You level up really slowly in this game. I've been playing for hours, and I still have not reached level 67. I'm getting close. Give me a break. Please stop redirecting me to Rusty's site. For the love of God, I hate all those people. Every single one of those stupid motherfuckers, except Greg's. Greg's, I will always love Greg's. Even when he criticizes me, I'll fucking respect the shit out of him. And I won't say a goddamn thing. I've never, I don't think I've ever said a, one single negative thing about Greg's. I like Greg's. I don't know why. I just respect the fuck out of him. Greg's can call me a fucking idiot, douchebag, tell me to get the hell out, 
kick my ass out, and he could. If uh, the images that he posted are true, he could beat the ever-living shit out of me. And I would still respect the hell out of him. I like Greg's. I'm starting to sound like I'm gay for him because I keep talking about him. But no, I just, I respect Greg's that much. I always have, I always will. Don't kick me off your fucking forum. Okay, I have a lot to give as far as the Diablo 4 side of things goes. And I'm trying to provide as much information as I can. You know, on that side of things. Like how, how much ass I kick. And how pathetic um, some YouTubers are. Um, how, like, level 90 to 100 players aren't all that great, all things considered. You know, it, it's Diablo's not just about the stats and the builds, um, what equipment you have. It's about your skill as a player. And I'm, I'm proving that your skill as a player is the most important thing about Diablo. Which is why I am attracted to action RPGs in the first place. I like... Um, I like... Having battles... Being determined by my skill. Like my physical skill as a person. As opposed to random number rolls. You get what I'm saying? Dice rolls. Dice rolls, that is more appealing to me if that's in Las Vegas or something and there's real money on the line. Then, yeah, I can get into dice rolls. Uh, if you're talking just about you're sitting on your ass at home playing a fucking RPG, um, I don't want to have nothing to do with dice rolls. I want my own destiny, destiny to be in my own hands. Like how I how I control my character, what I do, my decision making in the moment. I like that. That's why I prefer action RPGs. I always have. You know, and when I'm in a fucking casino, drunk out of my mind, I, I have yet to be to a casino. But if I am in a casino, God help me, somebody is there to stop me from uh, just throwing all my money away or you know maybe like a uh, an attractive female escort could be there to stop me and take me back to the limo and uh, you know or whatever we're talking about dreams okay but I excel at action RPGs and I wish people would stop harassing me is all I want. I want people to stop harassing me and trying to get me into like old school shit. This and that. I'm I'm action RPG all the way. Always will be. I was born and raised that way. That's the way I am now. I'm gonna fucking die an action RPG gamer. And you can make fun of me for it all you want. And I'm not gonna feel bad for it. I won't. I don't even remember what this video was about in the first place. What the fuck was I talking about in the first place? That's exactly what I'm talking about. Life is about... This is going to be the last video I make for tonight because... I feel like I'm making good points but scatterbrained and nothing is connecting. This is the last video I make tonight. Unless I do something really fucking badass.